Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can reset the user interface. Uh, so let's say that you get rid of, uh, for example, the properties options or the project browser. I'm not going to do it, but you know, I really like my user interface. But if you lost it, there is a couple of ways how you can do that. You could manually reset uh, the whole... Uh, 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 let me see, oh, oh, oh. go to program files, then the Autodesk, Revit uh, 24. And you can get rid of this file to reset it completely. It has a four gigs. Uh, don't do it, don't reinstall that, you don't have to. Uh, what we have to do though in uh, this option is a little bit different than it, it's at AutoCAD. I really like AutoCAD option where you just go to file, you go to options, and somewhere in here you have uh, the profiler reset. We don't have that in uh, Revit, so we can do it manually. What we actually have to do, we have to go to the view option, as you can see, and you have view templates, uh, blah, 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 couple of options that we don't actually need and on the far right actually we have the user interface here we have all of those informations that we are using for example navigation bar this one uh, project browser this one we can add a uh, system browser easily just like that we can we have properties this one me ep uh, fabrication parts what else uh, paid uh, modeler status bar uh, work set and design options we have browser organization obviously uh, you can add more and more via, via different plugins so remember if you get rid of any of your uh, preset options like all your Preset the interface, you can easily change it back to the original state. Either you can, uh, well, I don't recommend to reinstall the whole 40 gigs of uh, information. But there are a couple of ways how you can do it. This is just like the first eight option for you and uh, for you and uh, maybe for your team if uh, something goes south. So that's about it guys. If you have any types of questions, please leave them underneath this video and I'll get back to you as quickly as I can. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one. Have a great day and goodbye.